Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Juice Baseball channel. And welcome back to another episode of the Juice Road to the Show series here on MLB The Show 24. We are in the postseason for Juice's return to the Cleveland Guardians. In the last episode, we wrapped up our time with, who were we with, the Dodgers? Is that who we were with last year? I think that's who we were with. Yeah, we wrapped up our time with the Dodgers. And then we signed a deal with the Cleveland Guardians to return home. At 40 years old, we returned to the team that started it all. The team that drafted us all the way back in 2024. I can't believe that it's been this long already. As you can see by our MLB service time, 23 long seasons. And I haven't really missed that many games over my career. And I've been on a run of playing every single game for the past, what is that, seven years? Something like that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight years. I've played every single game. Call me the new Iron Man. I am Iron Man. Unbelievable. 72 home runs, hitting 314, as you would expect. And you may have peeped the total career hits. 4,395. Yes, I did beat the hit total from the king, former king, Pete Rose. We now are the king in every statistical hitting category that matters for a season and for a career. Sol solely solidifying us, even though it was already solidified 10 times over before, but absolutely now giving us every single record. We are now the greatest to ever step onto a baseball field and pick up a baseball bat. Now, obviously, we're not going to get the stolen base numbers because we just don't simulate very well in terms of sim uh, terms of stealing bases. If you go to our career stolen base numbers, we have a total of 409. We just don't steal bases very often in simulation because we're just not that kind of player. But that doesn't really matter because we have every other hitting record and a uh, uh, position player record that matters. So we have them all. We are now owner of every single one. The only thing left to do is to win another World Series. As you can see, we have plenty, plenty of different awards. Our hardware, we had to build a whole other house just to contain all of the trophies and memorabilia that we possess from our time in Major League Baseball. Will this be the final season? This very well could be the last episode. We could be seeing... The Juice play his final games in Major League Baseball, or we could go another year. I literally have no idea. I've talked about this past couple episodes. I literally have no idea when this is going to end because I'm pretty sure I can't choose. I don't think there's a way for me to retire. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> I, I honestly don't. I don't know if there's a way for me to. Like I can't click on myself in here. I don't know if there's a button to retire like in 2K or in, in Madden where you can like go over to the very end and it says like retire or something. I don't see that anywhere. Obviously it wouldn't be anything here. I, I don't, I don't, I don't know if there's a way that I can retire. Uh, so we're just going to have to find out if this is the final season. We're kind of just waiting. Now I did record the 4,000 or the hit that broke the record. I could show it, but there was not any, um, celebration there wasn't even an acknowledgement in game because i jumped into the game that i broke the record in and there wasn't even an acknowledgement of me breaking the all-time hit record i think the only acknowledgements they have are when you break at least the ones that i've seen are the ones when you break the hit the home run records so it's kind of unfortunate kind of annoying actually that you you break such a impressive such an improbable unbreakable record and they don't have any knowledge of it maybe that's the reason maybe they didn't code it into the game because they didn't think anybody would ever try to break the record but i did i broke it so there wasn't an acknowledgement i guess i could show you guys the hit that breaks the record just be just because just to prove to you that i, I did record it so here you go here is the hit that broke the hit record and made the juice the all-time hit king Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. And he's gone yard again. 
Home run number 40 on the year. And they add a pair. It's 11 nothing. Zingy, he's been red hot. Yeah, another big swing of the bat for him. Man, he is really seeing the ball well in this one. If you hit the ball that far, you know we're going to check the numbers. Let's go back to the nerd herd and stack cast. That was impressive. Yeah, wow. I mean, they don't hit him much farther than that, Boog. Everything's got to come together to hit a ball like that. And he really showed us something right there. As you can see, it's not very special <laughs> or anything like that. There wasn't even an acknowledgement that I did it. But that is the hit that broke the record. And now, as you can see, we are here into deep postseason play we are in the nl or the alds and we are currently up 3-1 on the mariners in the actually we're in the cs excuse me uh we're in the alcs because we we beat the red Sox. it took us a while i didn't jump in any of these games these are all simulation uh we beat the red Sox, so we moved on to the nlcs and then we take in three straight so far against the mariners losing the first game so hopefully we can jump in play this final game hopefully what will be the final game we jump in, we play this game, and then we move on to the World Series. We get that done, and then maybe it's over after the World Series. Like, like, I, like I've been saying, I have no idea when this series will end. I have absolutely no idea. I'm confused. I'm, I'm as curious as you are. We will, we will go until we retire. I just don't know when that will be. I mean, we've, they've acknowledged it right there, I guess, the MLB career hits leader. It would have been nice for you to acknowledge that actually when I did it in the game, uh, but apparently they didn't care enough. So, but like I've been saying, we will go until the career is over. Whenever we retire, that could be this episode, could be four episodes, five episodes from now. Who knows? Who really knows when the juice is going to retire? But we can't think about retirement right now. We got to think about our game right now because yeah, we're up four nothing. But if we want to take home playoff MVP. We're going to have to not fly out to the outfield. We're going to have to hit some bombs. We have not been doing well in simulation. We never really do that well in simulation. There it is. That's the stroke I needed. Stroke! That's what I needed right there. Put two more on the board. Eight nothing. We should be pretty uh, comfortable in this one now. Oh, it's even nine nothing now. Okay. I'll take that. Ooh, that one felt good off the bat. That should carry over the wall. He's going to jump and did he catch it? He did. Wow. The center fielder. No longer Julio Rodriguez, obviously, because we're 23 years deep. So he's probably retired or at the least very, very old. Uh, but he's no longer the starting center fielder in Seattle. But what a catch. What an athletic catch. That's a grounder. 10-1, to 1, top of the ninth. I only had one home run in this game. Luckily, we're going to win it and move on to the World Series. But pretty rough game. Pretty rough game. We do win the pennant. And remember, every year that I was on the Cleveland Guardians, when they call, since they called me up, we won a World Series. We started off our career with six straight World Series. So we can't ruin that now that we're back. We have to go and win a seventh World Series. We've already established ourselves as the greatest Guardian of all time, but we got to we gotta back that up by coming back in and, and doing it all over again now that we're here the second time around. We take on the St. Louis Cardinals in the World Series. I was kind of hoping to be the Reds. I mean, that'd be pretty cool. Playing against the Reds, the, the battle for Ohio means even more in the World Series. That'd be awesome. But we're taking on them boys in St. Louis. And we're going to hope that the City Connect jerseys give us some good luck. Because I really need to hit a little bit better if I want to win not only World Series MVP, but playoff MVP. I'm going to go two here because all we do is hit doubles and dingers. You guys know this. So there's a big time bomb. You love to see it. Nice little double. Three to one loss or uh, three to one Cardinals are winning right now. We're losing to the St. Louis Cardinals. That's not good, but I'll make it three to two. There we go. Easy does. I love the walk after the, the no doubt celebration. Pretty funny. All right. This might have to be my series. The Cardinals could be a pretty solid team, so I'm going to have to step it up put it into overdrive if i'm gonna want to win another world series for cleveland Ooh, a little bit ahead of that one a little bit out in front miguel vila not the greatest pitcher for cardinals in the postseason but they trusted him here in game one that i don't think is going to get out but it will bounce off the wall no it gets out i did not think that had the trajectory 
trajectory. I thought that was going to bounce off the wall. It looked like it was hooking uh, downward, but it does carry over. That was, a, that was a frozen rope. That one got out in a hurry. Five to four. Another runner on first. Ooh, not a home run, but I will advance the runner. Is he going to go three? He will not. Okay. Okay. Probably would have been thrown out. Yeah, he probably would have been. But it's five to four, bottom seven. We just got to hold on. Pitching needs to do their thing, and they did. Guardians take game one. We come back. We get a big victory. I obviously contributed a little bit there. Two home runs and two singles. All right. Three more games to go. Three more games to go in what could possibly be the final season of the Juice. Now I keep saying that, and, and who knows what happens, but we're going to find out. Game number two, we're hitting 302 in the post or in the, the World Series. Or is that in the postseason? I think that might just be in the postseason. I don't think they changed the, the averages just for the World Series, so I think that's the postseason. Ooh, the Cardinals got their powder blue on. Or their sky I guess that would that be sky blue? Or is that powder blue? Maybe it's a royal blue. Not hundred percent sure. They got blue unis, <laughs> basically. I'm not a big fan of the blue unis with the red trim. It just doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel like it's should go together and it really doesn't like i don't i'm not a big fan of the blue cardinal unis oh i missed it i think i did or is it gonna go out oh, i missed i knew i just something felt off about that hit something just didn't feel right about that hit and i was i was correct that's kind of annoying that one might not get out either oh man we might be going 1-1 in the series. Bottom of the eighth, nobody's on base. The only thing I can do is make it a one-run lead or one-run game. I do make it a one-run game, but I really wish I had a couple of guys on base there. That would have helped me out. As long as we can tie it and get to the extra innings, give me one chance to walk it off, and I'll do that. Please, don't end it. No. Oh, we did. We walked off anyway. Okay, I'll take that. W. I don't know who did it, but we walked it off without me. Obviously, I helped because I had that home run to bring us down to just one. But I'll take that. A huge walk-off makes it a 2-0 series lead. Two more games, and we've got ourselves another trophy to add to the cabinet amongst all the others. At this point, we might as well just start like selling them on Craigslist or something, Facebook Marketplace. We, we got all the trophies. that We don't need any more trophies. We've got them all, but they just keep giving them to me. I'm that awesome. I'm that dominant. Game three, we're finally on the road here in St. Louis. Juan Velez on the mound. I really need to raise this average up. That's a good way to do it. First pitch, home run, top of the second. That one's going into the stands for a souvenir. That's a great way to start. All right, but the Cardinals, they're, this Cardinals team is probably one of the more tough, tough teams we've faced in the World Series. They are very deserving to be here they're giving us a big oh it's gonna curve foul isn't it oh that's got to be just like a half an inch okay eight, eight feet outside <laughs> it looked like it was a lot closer than that but the cardinals are one of the tougher teams we've faced here in the world series they're giving me a lot of problems but not that many problems because that's a two-run bomb to left field Did that no that's in stands i thought that might have gotten over the stance for a second gotta raise that average up three to two Let's make it 4-2. It's the only way to go. Boom! Such a crispy sound off the bat. Perfect, perfect into left field. It is off of the apartment buildings behind the stadium. That's like right outside there. I don't know what that is, but it's off of that building. Maybe it's not an apartment. I don't know what it is, but it's off that building. Ooh, that one, I got underneath it. I don't know if that's, yeah, that's not going to go out. And it's, oh, I didn't even realize it was 5-4 to four Cardinals lead. That might be a loss unless we win it in, in the ninth, the bottom half. No, we lose. Oh, I, I should have paid it more attention. I would have at least tried to get a better swing on that. Maybe I still wouldn't have had anything good happen, but we do suffer our first loss of the World Series. So now instead of sweeping them out in four, we have to go to five, hopefully. Ah, it's annoying. We should have got that win. I really wish I wouldn't have missed that home run at the end there. That could have really helped us out. I mean, it would have tied it. And then who knows what happens from there. Maybe we still lose. That's possible, but oh, that's annoying. Okay, let's go to game four. Let's go to game number four. 
and hopefully get this done. We've got ourselves a runner on, and we're going to move him to second. That third baseman did a really good job of stopping that from going to the outfield. Good job there, third baseman, but still a base hit regardless. Ooh, 2 nothing in the top of the fourth. And that should be out of here, maybe? Is that going to go? It seems like it's going to be short. It is short. Okay. Yeah, some of these I'm just not getting all of it, even though I feel like I should be. I'm just missing them for some reason. I don't know why. I wish I wasn't, but there we go. That's not a miss. That is an absolute no-doubter into center field, into the, the batter's eye type of little grassy area they got out there. That's a big-time bomb. Top of the eighth. Okay, we are going to be able to secure this one. At least, I would think so. It's now 7-1 to one in the top of the eighth. I, if I, if the Cardinals come back and win this game and make it 2-2, two -two, then they deserve to win the whole World Series because that would be an insane comeback with only like an inning and a half to go. But they don't. We secure the W, and that is a 3-1 series lead over the, Cle or the uh, St. Louis Cardinals. Absolutely brilliant. You love to see it. This is going to plan. I mean, I wish it would have been four games, but hey, five will work too. As long as it's not six, as long as we don't have to go back to Cleveland. Even though I would like to go back and win the championship in front of the home fans. I mean, they had six years of championships when we first started. They've seen championships. Now, it has been like 20 years since that happened. Ooh, and they're going to start off with an intentional walk. Okay. Okay. We lead 3-1 to one in the third, but they're intentionally walking me here in my first at-bat. And that is why. That should carry all the way, I think. I don't think, yeah, it is going to carry all the way. That's why you intentionally walk the juice. I'm like Babe Ruth, Ted Williams, Shohei Otani, everybody. Hank Aaron, everybody rolled up into one. Barry Bonds, without the steroids. I've been clean my whole life, baby. I'm clean. I'm clean as a whistle. Test me. I'm all natty. That, I don't think it's going to get out. Is that going to No, it's not. Warning track power. But it is 4-1. to one. We just need to hold on. And we can hold a championship again. Oh, my God. The Cardinals are clawing their way back. It is 5-4. We got to extend this lead. We need some insurance. I need the Geico lady right here, right now. We need some insurance. Come on, Juice. You've been doing this for 20 years. One more home run's not going to kill you. Oof. A little bit early on that. Ward Herzog. What a... Or, yeah, Ward Herzog. What a name. But he's added to the list of people I've hit a home run off of. My list has got to be like a novel. It's got to be like the, the freaking Lord of the Rings books. <laughs> the Simmer, Simmerillion, whatever it's called. It's, it's extensive, the list of pitchers that I've hit a home run off of. Top of the ninth. Oh my God! The 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 Cardinals have brought it to a one run deficit for us. And of course, in the clutch time, I didn't get it done again. We are going back to Cleveland. You've got to be kidding me! You've got to be kidding me! How did we blow that? How did we blow that? We gave up three runs in the bottom of the eighth. You got to be joking, bro! What is happening to this team? Oh, we're going back to Cleveland for Game Six. We have to secure it in Cleveland. It has to happen. We shouldn't even have gotten this this far. We should have ended it in Game 4. We couldn't do that. We certainly should have ended it in Game 5. We couldn't do that. So let's end it here. Game 6 at our place. We got the City Connects on. We're feeling good. You look good. You play good. You feel good. You eat good. Everything. Let's just get the job done and get out of here. This Cardinals team is pesky. It's not a good start, though. Not a good start. It's already one nothing. I didn't even realize that when I was up to bat the first time. It's already one nothing. Okay, Juice, let's get this done. That's not even a good hit. Why is it telling me good timing? That's not a that's not a good hit. What are we doing here? Oh my god, I need the teammates to do something here, please. It's still one nothing, bottom six. Oh my god, let's focus up. Let's focus up. Oh, please, carry. That's got a lot of steam to it. Please, get over. Thank God. Oh, it's not over. I, what? I could have sworn that hit off the top of the wall for a home run. 
I guess not. It's a double. And it's 4-3 to three bottom 8. you got to be kidding me, bro. This Cardinals team is annoying. I'm tired of them. I thought it was cool that we were playing the Cardinals at the beginning. I don't, I don't think it's cool anymore. I'm tired of this, this St. Louis Cardinals team, and I want them to go fall down. That's what we needed. That's an emphatic home run. Ties this game in the bottom half. Woo! Get me to the ninth. Oh, we did it. Okay, we didn't even need to get to the ninth. I was going to say, get me to the ninth so that I can walk it off for us, but we did it ourselves. We win another World Series. That is seven World Series in seven tries with the Cleveland Guardians. We are perfect. Every time we got to the World Series, we won it with the Cleveland Guardians. That's pretty awesome. And it continues our streak of, what is that, f five in a row? Four in a row now? I can't remember exactly. Let me do a little bit of of uh, looking here. How many is it in a row? Let's see. We won. We won with the Yankees. We won with the Mets. We won with the Marlins. We won with the Dodgers. So it is. It's one, two, three, four, and then five. So this is six in a row, actually. Six uh, World Series in a row. Oh, that feels good. I thought for sure we were going to lose that game, man. I thought for sure that we were going to lose that game. It just felt like it was inevitable we were going to lose. Whew, thank you that no, we didn't. Scared me. The Guardians win a World Series. You love to see it. Absolutely beautiful. Let's open this annoying little pack here. It's probably not going to give me anything worthy. Uh, I mean, it's diamond bats, but... I already have a pretty good bat that gives me better stuff than... I don't know, the 9 power is pretty decent. I'll pick that one up. I'm probably not going to switch to it, but... Play style, is it better than the bat that I have? I'm rocking a... What bat am I even rocking? I'm rocking the, the J-Rod Show Bat, which has the same exact power. Okay, so it's not really... You know what? I'll switch to this one. I'll switch to the 20, uh, 2K1 Maple. Might as well. Sure, why not? Okay. So what I want to do now before we get into like all the offseason stuff, because this could be the last time that we see we can see anything, because I don't know what's going to happen when we retire. Like I don't know if we're going to be able to see anything. So I want to go to where do I want to go? I want to go to achievements. Here we go. Wait, no, I want to go to my achievements. Not how do I see my achievements? Uh, is it down here? It might be down here. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Stats and awards. Okay, this is what I wanted to go to. So, let's scroll down all the way, all the way to when we first started. And let's count up all of the World Series, because that's the only award that we can't see uh, how many how many we've won. Oh, man. I thought that I, I didn't think that I got to the very bottom. That's the only award that we can't see how many we've won of. They don't have it, like, tallied anywhere. So, let's go all the way. And, and look, I, you'd think that my Hall of Fame potential would be busted by now, because... Of all we've done. Okay, so let's get all the way to the end. Okay, so all we can get to is 2032. That's the lowest we can get to. We know for a fact that we won that we won six championships in six years with the Cleveland Guardians. And look at the career earnings that we made. Six hundred and fifty seven million. That's unfortunate that's a lot of money, but that's like just like two hundred more than what Shohei's making. <laughs> it's kinda crazy what Shohei's getting paid. Uh, but yeah, that's still a lot of money. Okay, first off, before we do that, how many when did we first join with the with the Rangers? We joined with the Rangers back in 2030. So we had 2 years that we can't see. I don't think I won any World Series with them in the first 2 years, so we're just going to say that we didn't. We're just going to say that we didn't win any World Series cuz I'm pretty sure I only won 3 with the Rangers. I'm pretty sure that's what happened. Cuz last time we looked at that, I think I I said I only had won 3. So let's get back to it. And start all the way down at 2032. So we know that we have six right off the bat because we won six with the Guardians. I, rem I know that for a fact. So we can start with six World Series. And then we can get to 2032. And we can go from there. So start 2033. Okay, let's go up from here. We won the World Series. No, that's the home run champion. Okay, never mind, never mind. So we keep going up. Uh, win a World Series. Nope. Still going. Still going. We didn't win that many World Series with the... With the Rangers, that's for sure. Won the division series. We didn't get very far. Uh, one championship series. We're getting closer. <laughs> no, nothing, nothing, nothing. There it is. There's a World Series. That's seven. So I must have won the first two. 
because I know we won three with the Rangers, so I must have won the first two. So that's uh, that's nine World Series trophies so far. Then we signed with the Blue Jays for two seasons. I know for a fact that we didn't win any of them with the Blue Jays. We didn't win any World Series. We did win the Triple Crown, but we're still at nine World Championships. This is ten because we won one with the Yankees. Yep, there's ten. The Mets is eleven because we won with the Mets. So that is eleven. The Marlins is 12. We won with the Marlins. Then we go to the Dodgers is 13 or 12. What did I say? Crap. Did I say 12 or 13? I think it's 13 because we won with the Dodgers. And then now with the Guardians, it's 14. So we've won 14 World Championships, 14 World Series. I'm pretty sure that's correct. I don't know. <laughs> I think that's right. I think that's right, but now let's find out for sure if this is the beginning of the end. View the retired players. I don't see us on here, so I don't think that we're retiring. I would feel like it would show me like right at the top if I was retiring. Nolan Schonel is now retired, <laughs> but I don't think we are. No, we're still a player. We're still a baseball player. Awesome. I have a new contract offer from the Marlins. Well, I don't want to be a Marlin. I want to be a, a Guardian. I guess I can't stay a Guardian unless they offer me another contract. So I was hoping they would offer me like a player option or something, but I guess that's not. Oh, here we go. Yes. Do you wish to accept the qualifying offer of one year, 24.3 million? I do want to accept that because I want to stay with the Cleveland Guardians until my career is over. So we can sim the off season. We are done there. Perfectly done. And we will sim through spring training. Are we going to go undefeated? Oh, I thought we were going to go undefeated for a second. We'll get through spring training. And then we'll start the season. Spring training has come to an end. Advance to the regular season. And here we are. We are done with that year. Another world championship in the books. And we are right back to another season. So it looks like we didn't retire. I wonder when we are going to retire. What I might do. What I might do is I might just simulate a bunch of seasons until we retire and then kind of do like a wrap-up uh, when it happens in the, in the final episode because I feel like we've done everything we need to do. We've, we've, won, uh, we've won all the championships we need to win. We've won all the MVPs we need to win. We've won Hank Aarons. We've won Triple Crowns. We've won the Home Run Derby, the All-Star Game. Uh, the batting title, playoff MVP, World Series MVP. We've done everything that we could fo physically possibly ever do in baseball. We've got all the records, everything. We don't need to focus on anything like that. So what I might do is I might just simulate after we get done with this episode. Actually, I might just end the episode here because there's no, there's really no business uh, playing again because usually the only reason we jump in and play a few games to start the season is to see the the new team but we're still on the guardians so what i might do is i might just end it the episode here and i think we are going to cut back down to to a more respectable hairstyle <laughs> i could go with this one that's kind of funny we might go back down to a little bit more manageable hairstyle now that we're in our super old age we're 40 years old so we could go... I might go Dred's Bun. That might be interesting. Or maybe we go with the parted side. The slick back. Uh, I don't want to go like too short. But maybe we go with the short parted wave. That's more along the lines of what we had originally. Let's go back to that one. We'll still stay with the Silver Fox hairstyle. We'll stay with the Silver Fox. And we'll trim the beard up. No more Santa beard. Wherever the Santa... Here's the Santa beard. We'll trim up the beard. No more Santa beard. We'll go back down to a, a little bit more reasonable little beard. Okay, there we go. That's that's a reasonable uh, retiree hairstyle. <laughs> the Santa beard was fun, but that's a more reasonable hairstyle to retire with. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to end the episode here. And I'm going to simulate the rest of the career. Whether that's just one more season or maybe it's two, maybe it's three, however many it ends up being. I'm going to simulate those seasons. I'm not going to jump in. I'm not going to do anything like that. The stats will be all simulated. And so we will we'll wrap up the episode of the next episode. I will recap what happened and do all that kind of stuff. We'll go over 
possible uh, like historic numbers and all that kind of stuff. We'll do everything that we can in the next episode. I don't know how long that episode is going to be. Probably not too long because I have no idea how long or how much you can see once you've retired. Like I've said before, I've never retired in MLB The Show. I've never gotten this far, so I have no idea what happens. So I'm going to simulate every season left that we have, and I will show you guys like the recap if we won a World Series or anything like that. And then, uh, yeah, we'll wrap it up in the next episode. The next episode will be the finale. However many seasons it ends up being, it'll be the finale. We will catch up, we'll recap all of the seasons that I simulated, and we will fish officially retire the juice in the next episode, the greatest player of all time. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, join the Juice Club. Thank you so much. Stop by and watch. I truly appreciate it. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.